This is how a typical web user interacts with a web server. So when a web client wants to go to a site like cnn.com or yahoo.com, they type in the URL in their favorite browsers and they go over the internet and they reach a web server where the content is then routed back to the internet and then displayed on their browsers. If you really want to understand what is going on between the web clients and the web server, you need to leverage a tool such as Burp Proxy. A proxy tool shows the request that is sent from the web client to the web server and it also captures the response coming back from the web server to the web clients. Now let's see how that picture looks like. So you have the web users in the left hand side and there is a burp proxy in between the internet and the uh, web user. So though it is shown as a separate software, it is actually installed in the laptop. And um, the burp proxy can capture all the transactions that are going between your web, the computer and the web server.